Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues Journal Club. I am Mr. Zaman and today I'll talk to you all about a unique case of focal pancreatitis termed groove pancreatitis. Groove pancreatitis or GP is an unusual form of chronic segmental pancreatitis that affects the pancreatic groove between the pancreatic head, the duodenum and the common bile duct also known as the groove area. Now most physicians are still unfamiliar with an entity. It's a rare pancreatic condition. A recent case report published in the Journal of Clinical Imaging Science has shown that it is challenging to make the diagnosis of groove pancreatitis or GP on imaging. The report by researchers from NKP Salve Institute of Medical Sciences and Research Center Nagpur also highlighted the importance of having a high index of its suspicion when a pancreatic head abnormality is detected to avoid unnecessary surgical intervention which can be avoided in cases of GP. It was the case of a 21-year-old patient who was male and came to the emergency department with complaints of sharp upper abdominal pain irradiating to the back and a few episodes of vomiting. The abdominal ultrasonography was performed. A hypoechoic lesion was noted in the space bounded by the pancreatic head and duodenum wall, which showed no vascularity on color Doppler. The division of second part of the duodenum appeared to be thickened. Cystic changes were noted in the paraduodenal space, which is compressing over the lumen of the duodenum. The pancreatic body and tail were unremarkable. Main pancreatic duct and CBD were not dilated. There was no obstruct or encasement of peripancreatic vessels throughout their course. On preliminary plane CT, a hypodense soft tissue density mass sheet-like appearance was noted in the pancreaticoduodenal groove associated with minimal surrounding inflammatory stranding of the fat and thickening of the duodenal wall. An ill-defined peripherally enhancing cyst was noted in the periphery of the duodenum, which appeared to be compressing over the lumen of the duodenum, causing focal stenosis. After contemplating and combining the clinical and imaging findings, the case was interpreted as a case of GP. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.